Hello and welcome to this short screencast on the easy plot command. So what is the easy plot command? It sounds pretty nice. Well we know the plot command in MATLAB for producing plots of two-dimensional functions uh, involves a se several step process. We create a vector of inputs, use a formula to create a vector of outputs, and then use the plot command to plot the points that we create. But there's a simpler way to do this if we're just looking for a quick and dirty plot of a function. And like I said, it's called easy plot. Let me show you how it works. So let's suppose I want to plot the function y equals x squared. I'm going to type e z plot, just like that, and then parenthesis. And then I'm going to do something a little different uh, than we do with the plot function. I'm going to use a quote, a single quotation mark, and then I'm going to type in the formula for my function, x squared, close the quote, close the parenthesis. Now before I hit the enter command here, I just want to point out uh, some a very important couple of differences between easy plots syntax and the plot function syntax. First of all, uh, we're using quotes because we're entering in basically what in computing we call a string. A string is uh, different from a number or a vector in the sense that a string is like text. And so really what I'm doing here is just writing in text, the text that I would write by hand if I were writing the function y equals x squared on a piece of paper. And notice that since this is a string, I don't have to have the dot in front of the caret here. This is not, x is not a vector. You notice in my workspace I don't have any variables defined. x is just a symbol that I'm passing to MATLAB. And so I don't have to worry about element-wise squaring like I do in the plot command where I'm squaring a vector. So I'm just going to type easy plot, quote, and then type in the formula and the quotes and the parenthesis. When I hit enter, it produces a very simple plot of y equals x squared. Now some things to note about the output here. Notice that it automatically uh, echoes the text string that you entered in back as a plot title, and it puts it on a nice standard set of axes. The standard uh, domain that it uses is negative 2 pi to plus 2 pi. Now again, this is much different from plot because we're not plotting a vector, we're actually plotting a symbolic expression, which is uh, quite unusual for MATLAB. But it's also not quite as nice as plot because I would then have to go into the plot tools window uh, to change anything I want to change. And I can do that, but uh, as we'll see in another screencast, there's no way I can pass any sort of option to easy plot to make, for example, the thickness come out thicker or put a grid on it automatically. Now there are some options that I can use with easy plot. If I don't like the domain negative 2 pi to 2 pi, I can specify a new domain like so. I can type easy plot parenthesis and then the formula again and then simply a, a comma and give it a vector that contains the uh, minimum x and the maximum x. So for example to plot the parabola from 0 to 5, I just type 0, 5 as a vector and plot it again and the figure is behind the window here but there it is as you see. And so I can plot all kinds of functions here, easy plot uh, for example, uh, x times cosine x, and I produce my new plot here. So all other plot options you see on the plot you create through EasyPlot have to be done through the plot tools window. And again, that is possible to do uh, just by opening it up. I can change color and add annotations as I like. So easy plot is a nice command to know to use if you're trying to create just a quick, simple plot of a mathematical function. It's not as flexible as the plot command, but it is, like the name suggests, easy. Thanks for watching.